Hello friends, welcome back to Movie Community College. I hope you didn't go away long. There's really like no that, reason to leave. I look like that Bitmoji. Which one is that? With the one that's got his mouth open looking all crazy? There are a few, so I, you'd have to be a little more specific um, than that. I Two things for you, India. Um, I got a text from my son, and he wants to ask you something, and this is, so there, there's a text. Uh, yeah, don't look, put that on screen. That has his number there, dear. Oh, it does? It yeah. says, um, you should ask India if they've ever heard of the Domino's Pizza Burger. Domino's mm -hmm. rolled it out a couple of years ago in India, mm -hmm. and he thinks that it sounds awful, a pizza burger. Hmm. So have you? do you know what that is? I don't know what that is. That does sound kind of strange, pizza burger. I would think burger would be... Burger, to me, has a... a connotation of beef right i don't know if i that's what i would be rolling it out to the vegetarians like i mean i suppose you could do soy you could do other things but right but pizza burger so i'm thinking okay you have a bun and then oh you so you think it's like a pizza oh i never thought about that way right. i thought it was like burger burger a has pizza. a bun burger has a bun i don't know um i saw something the other day about some of the weirdest foods that mcdonald's ever had was it in india no this was in america when mcdonald's was just getting started and um you know how a lot of catholic people don't eat meat mm -hmm. during the lent season mm -hmm. um they wanted to make a meatless burger but instead of coming up with something like a soy burger or a veggie burger they put on a bun a slice of pineapple with a slice of cheese on top of it that just sounds weird. Obviously, it didn't make it. And then they thought, hey, let's do the filet o fish which obviously caught on, so. No, uh, this video is a surprise for you. Oh, okay? I like surprises. This is a surprise for you. Mm. You have no idea what's coming to okay, you. Okay, should I cover my eyes? Um, this is, uh, I... this is a, a cricket match, I think, that was getting ready to happen between India and Pakistan. Okay. Is that the surprise? No, go close your eyes, close okay, your eyes, close okay, your eyes. Okay, okay. Tell me when I can open. Okay, you can open it. That is definitely a cricket match. India and Pakistan. 2016 I see up there. Wait a second. Hey! How do you know that? How I see him. That? Look, he's oh, right that's there. That's so ridiculous. He, what? You know, he's singing the national anthem. I know. How do you, you, how you know back. that? I want to see Big B again. I want to see Big B. Pan back. This is terrible camera work. Well, That's it's, terrible. It's, it's the guy with the cell phone. <laughs> what is it? Come hey, on. What's, who's what's doing going the camera on? work? It's a guy in his cell phone. Okay. Get back. There we go. Looky. Dude, stay on Big B. Listen, listen, everybody knows. Listen to that. Listen to the Crowder Rock. Right? Singing along with them. That's awesome. This is why I love India. Look this at this. This is so great. Uh, 
Uh, so this is what that it's that was this, so. This cool. is what it's like when we watch an Amitab <laughs> film in my house. This is what it turns into. Yeah. Tish gets out her Indian flag and begins waving <laughs> it and starts yelling and screaming Ooh. and uh, you know. And then she makes me reenact scenes from Dwar. Um, well, that's not actually what happens, but I'm usually transfixed when Big B is on the screen because he's phenomenal. He's an awesome actor. He's an awesome dancer. He's clearly an awesome singer. Everything he does, he does it with excellence. Um, Big B, you should come to America to... Our house. Shouldn't he come to the Super Bowl next year and sing the Star Spangled Banner? Yes. Shouldn't yes. he sing our national yes. anthem at the Super Bowl? Yes. That would be so cool. And then I will paint my body like the Indian cricket fan does. That looks like the. And I'm just but it would be the American flag because no, it's I'll a Super Bowl. Indian, um, okay. I love patriotism. I'm very patriotic. I'm Captain America, basically. Um, so that was super cool just to see, um, just to be able to feel the spirit. But of course, then it's even amped up because it's Big B singing your national anthem. Um, India. If you want to see the equivalent of the best ever American national anthem, you should go watch the YouTube clip of Whitney Houston singing the Star Spangled Banner at the 1991 Super Bowl. That will bring chills to you. I promise you. Yes. Um, the Coracon monthly podcast is coming. Uh, okay. I need to double check the dates, but we're going to do that every month. I'm excited to do that with Coracon. Hi, Coracon. Hello, Coracon. Um, and then uh, I may be doing a podcast with my son and one of his reporter buddies who right. works the breaking news desk. Yes. And I have no idea what they have in mind. No I, it feels to me like um, mm. highly questionable. Mm. I have become poppy. I've got a, you, can, you can Google that. Right. And then one last thing. One last thing for you, India. Sita sings the blues. This is starting to come into my sphere of understanding. And I'm curious on what your reaction is to Sita Sings the Blues. You should um, probably post a question in the community yes. tab. Yes, I've seen it and I've, I've heard, <clears throat> I've watched a clip of it and was mesmerized by imagery of Ramyana put to 1930s blues jazz music American style. Interesting. Just saying. And it's creative common, so you can, you can reproduce it as all you want. Say okay. hey. We have more videos Say, to hey. do. More hey, videos. kids, hey. We have more videos to do. Bye. Welcome to Trailer Trash, the finest movie trailers on the planet. Check out our humongous selection of movie trailers. We have horror trailers, we have comedy trailers, hell, we even have trailer reaction videos. Make sure you like and subscribe to this channel. Yeah!